Okay, our next. No queremos, no queremos que Cuba siga siendo invadido por los americanos. ¡Viva el pueblo cubano! ¡Viva el pueblo americano! Aquí estamos para la lucha, una lucha que se va a representar en favor del pueblo cubano. El pueblo que merece, un pueblo que se ha restringido desde hace décadas, décadas por el gobierno de América. No lo vamos a permitir. El pueblo unido jamás será vencido. El pueblo unido jamás será vencido. ¡Viva el pueblo americano! ¡Viva el pueblo cubano! ¡Viva Latinoamérica! together to oppose the U.S. sanctions on Cuba, the U.S. embargo, and to end the British complicity. For the Communist League and the Young Socialists, this protest to defend the Cuban Revolution is very important because for us the Cuban Revolution is an example to workers in this country and everywhere around the world that we can take power, transform society, and transform ourselves in the process. Above all, that's what working people in this country, that's what we need to do here, to uproot the, um, the capitalist exploitation and the doggy dog values that come with that system. For more than 60 years, Washington, along with the British rulers, has have tried to overthrow and unsuccessfully overthrow the Cuban Revolution. For that very reason, for following that, that political course. Because in Cuba, working pe ordinary working people like us here, they showed that we, we can make a revolution and that's the example that they want to eradicate. The biggest act of solidarity that we can give, that work, the working class in the, in the UK can give to Cuba is for the working class to take power here. And, you know, and if you're thinking this is a utopian idea, 
just remember this that the US rulers and the British rulers discounted the ability of the of the Cuban working people to make a revolution just as they discount our capacity to do the same here but once again um, I thank you for coming to this action and I hope to see your further actions in the first of the Cuban revolution and thank you very much